You know, we need you. 6.50 here on this Friday morning. Well, we have a few mad scientists taking over our studios today. Some UC Davis students are teaming up with the Discovery Museum. Tina checking out their experiments this morning. Hi there. Hey, I team. love this all about our health. Sheila Montgomery here from Discovery Museum. You have an exhibit coming up. I know that. But it's all about um, feeling better, helping our bodies and become more healthier. Yeah, so this weekend at the Discovery Museum, we have our Bone Zone exhibit, which is all about skeletons, health, nutrition. Mm -hmm. um, and to help us out, we have scientists from UC Davis that Hi, have <laughs> got their own program. Smart people. <laughs> and their program taught them to take their real research that they're doing at UC Davis right now and made it family friendly so the oh. kids can learn about the research that's going on. And a lot of them are health related. Kids get a science passport this weekend. Okay. They complete it, they get a science badge. But I'll let you meet some of the scientists that we have. You're Jenny? Now. I'm Gidika. <laughs> Gidika. Gidika. Okay, so this one is all about bacteria. Yes, I work with bacteria in the environment. So this is a lot about environmental health. Bacteria that do great things to keep um, our environment in good shape. And the way we study them in the lab, do you want to go ahead and oh. open some of these up? Okay. And we're just going to pretend they're bacteria. Like and the ones in oh. lakes and soil mm -hmm. and everywhere. infectious bacteria on our skin. <laughs> yeah. So they're everywhere, and when we look at them, they look very similar, and to study them in the lab, this is something like what we do, is crack them open, look at their DNA, and try to learn more about what they do. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. All right, now we have Jenny, right? Yes. Okay, what's yours about? So, I am a biomedical engineer, and I do oh, tissue yeah. engineering in the lab. So, oh, yeah. what I have here are actually some makeshift <laughs> cells, or what represents cells, and then this here is what we call a scaffold in the lab. So cells always need something to grab onto in all of your tissues and organs, but they also need a way to talk to one another. So what I have here represents signals. So you can go ahead and shake them in there. Like and, this? Yes, and evenly distribute them. Okay. So now you've combined the three essential elements of tissue engineering. So you have cells, scaffolds, and signals. Wow. I love that. <laughs> they make it easy for us. Right? Yay! 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 Very nice. Very nice. Okay, yours is a little bit complicated. Uh, it's not too bad. Okay, um, what is this one about? And you're Richard. I'm Richard, and I do uh, heart research at UC Davis. Okay. And uh, actually, this is a model demonstrating a blocked artery in your heart. Oh. And I'm going to show you how doctors at UC Davis Medical Center uh, unclog that. Okay. So if you can hold that, mm -hmm. if you can, I don't know if you can see, there's actually a blocked artery, and I'm going to do the fast version. Right here. Okay. And here's a balloon catheter, and I'm going to kind of place it in the right spot okay. and pump it up really quick. So balloon catheter. Oh, wow. And to go up just a little bit. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Like that? There you go. And you can see that now it's Whoa. opened up the pathway. And wow. that's exactly how uh, doctors at UC Davis Medical Center will um, help save you from a heart attack, basically. Balloon angioplasty. That's right, yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. I said a big word. Yes, yeah. you did. <laughs> and what is all this right over here? Well, so this is sort of demonstrating uh, this buildup of cholesterol and fats in your arteries is, you know, it, your diet can sort of contribute to that. So you want to you eat these foods and try to stay away from these foods, basically. Okay, take note, everybody. <laughs> healthy, not so healthy. <laughs> Let's keep all the cholesterol down. Right. Oh, my. Look at that. <laughs> hey, you make it nice and easy. And tell us again when the event is. So all the scientists are going to be at the museum this weekend. We have six on Saturday, five other ones on Sunday. It'll be from 1230 to 4 o'clock. Um, you can visit the scientists. It's included with museum admission. And uh, this is a really special weekend for us. These scientists have been working hard getting projects together that your kids can get their hands on and learn about this hard science, but in a fun manner. Yeah. And we really invite everyone to come out and meet them and have some fun learning about different science subjects. Thank you guys Very for cool. uh, you. You know, leading the way. I love Thank that, you. you know, and continuing on such wonderful work. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Back